We'll guide you through how to increase your download speed on your PS5 so you can download games faster. If you find these methods useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Make sure you watch this full video as I'm going over multiple different methods you can try. So firstly, what you want to do is head to your PS5 settings. So head to the top right and click on settings. Then what you want to do is scroll down until you see save data and game app settings and you then want to go down to automatic updates. Turn auto download off because your PS5 will automatically be updating your games. And so what may happen is that game update may be competing with the download you're trying to do. So you can just go and turn this off while you're trying to go and download the game and that should speed up your download. And for method number two is stop playing online games on your PS5 because this is also going to be using up your bandwidth on your PS5 and therefore your game will download slower. So stop playing online games, maybe play an offline one or go and do something else while you try and download the game. And that applies to other devices using your network as well. So maybe you've got a computer doing other downloads, make sure it's not doing any downloads. And if you're with other people using the same Wi-Fi, maybe you could ask them just to temporarily stop while you get this download done. For the next method, you can try using ethernet. And what ethernet is, is basically a direct connection between your PS5 and your router or an access point or a power line adapter. So it's basically a wired connection, also known as a LAN. And this will speed it up because it means it hasn't, isn't traveling wirelessly and it's directly connected with a wire. You may be thinking I'm nowhere near a router, but what you can do is get something called a power line adapter. I use it myself. And what that does is you place one next to your router and one anywhere in your house. And it basically puts your ethernet through your power in your house. Um, so yeah, you can get ethernet ports anywhere with a wall outlet, and then you can plug it into your PS5. And if you don't want to get one of them, you could always temporarily put your PS5 right next to your router with a monitor or a TV and just plug it in or just move it closer. So the Wi-Fi is sort of closer and it has to travel less distance that will speed it up. Once you've connected Ethernet, you will need to go into your settings, then into network and go into your network settings and set up internet connection. And in here, you'll need to go and scroll down. And when you've got an Ethernet plugged in, you'll have an option here for set up LAN. As you can see, I have a wired LAN network here. Mine isn't currently connected as I'm using my Ethernet wire elsewhere, but that is definitely a good way to go and speed up your internet is by using a wired connection. The next method is to come to your network settings again and go into connection status and click on test internet connection. So what you want to do is do an internet speed test because you want to make sure the speed you're getting is actually what you're paying for. Because when you sort of subscribe and pay an ISP for your internet connection, you're usually paying for a minimum amount of download speed. So do just ensure you're getting what you're paying for. There may be a fault in the line or another issue. So that's why it's good just to do a speed test. And I pay for 50 megabits and I'm getting that, which is perfect. So this wouldn't apply to me. But if yours is drastically lower than what you're paying for, it's definitely worth getting in contact with your ISP. And the download speed is most important here. So yeah, these methods should have hopefully gone and increased your download speed. Please go down below and leave a like.